breaking news, Nigerians. Thanks don't fool everywhere. Everywhere just day thanks. Concerning this presidential election petition, you know, a, a case one day before the tribunal. Now, not say 2023 presidential election. Well, I too much for the matter. Uh -huh. How the election to work out. And now, when we say they don't the courts now, Labour Party and Atiku Abubaka, Labour Party is a uh, their presidential candidate is uh, Peter Obi. Why of that uh, Peter uh, PDP is a uh, Alaji Atiku Abubaka. The two parties now then they caught the challenge for Lame Tinubu's victory during that 2023 presidential election. They say not win the election. And for that reason, they should be declared the winner. That they were rigged out by Professor Mahmoud Yakubo and all that. Now, Nigerian lawyers, Nigerian young lawyers, they don't come out, come warn the Nigerian CJN or Lawaru. Uh, Ka Olukayo Day. They say the case between President Tunubu, Peter Obi, and Atiku Abubaka in the presidential election petition. They say make them not do anything otherwise. Oh. Say because the world is watching. And they should not rob the Nigerian democracy on the mob by doing otherwise. You know what they mean by otherwise? Maybe declaring the wrong person, you know, as the winner. He said, may the courts not follow the trend of the INEC. Now, INEC has actually destroyed its reputation in Nigeria. And that is not what the judiciary should, be stand, uh, should stand for. According to them, they say the judiciary is the last man who better stand. And for that reason, they should stand for the truth. And as well, let Nigerians understand that they can only stand for the truth any time, any day, Nigerians. When I don't see what they happen, so welcome back to Prospect Channels TV. Thank you for this coming out here. If you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. Nigerian Young Lawyers sent strong message to the Nigerian CGN Olukai Ode Olawara consigning the case between President Bola Metinubu, the Labour Party presidential candidate Peter Obi and his counterpart from PDP Atiku Abubaka in the presidential election petition court in their words. We have we are all following this case with interest because we want Nigeria to be a better nation once again. All the evidence presented before the tribunal is actually working against Bola Metinbu, the Nigerian president. The court should stand for its rights. Nigerian democracy should not be destroyed. The court is the last man hope, and we will continue to uphold this. The Nigerian judiciary should not be dragged on the mob, they said. Nigerians, following the outcome of the 2023 presidential election in Nigeria, majority of people have expressed a high level of disappointment over the outcome of the election that produced Bola Metinubu as the Nigerian president. Different people in Nigeria has blamed the chairman of INEC, Professor Mahmoud Yakubo, for failing to fulfill the promises he made to the Nigerian citizens before the election started. Well, I remember, say, the INEC chairman said that with the use of Beaver's machine, the election is going to be transparent he also said Nigerians should not be afraid that their, their, their election is going to, their, their vote will be count, counted. Not be that one when they, they believe, say, if their vote finish, they go write name. They know they count. 
Uh -huh. You know, say that thing don't really discourage Nigerians from voting. So he preached to Nigerians. He made them believe that this election is going to be different from the previous one, the manual kind of, that they will use this machine. Other countries that have been using it, then they get perfect results. And for the sake say you don't still use them for in uh, uh, those states, they still use them for Anambra states. They still use for um, Oshun states. And the results they came out perfectly. Nigerians believed him. So during presidential election, something different happened. Then they speak English now. Say the reason why they could not upload the results at the real time electronically was because. And there was glitches, you know, that occur during the uh, uh, election and all that. So the, the beavers could not transmit results to IREV. So this is what Peter Obi and Atiku Abubaka are contesting against. That Tunubu did not win the election. They rigged the election and that was the reason why they did not upload the result at the real time just for them to have their have their way do what they want to do now people don't they talk they put for this matter nigerian young lawyers they don't still come out because they don't see see and say they don't see trust maybe these people too they don't tell them say we they look now everybody they look now and we're not going to feel drag judiciary on the mob now i neck not get respect again because of waiting they do we are not going to still feel carry us rob for mob. We, when they come out as young lawyers, they're not going to come, they respect us. Base say, they go come, they talk, say, we know they stand for the truth. You must declare the rightful winner of that election. And based on the evidence that is before the courts right now, Bola Metinibu gets so many questions to answer. Bola Metinibu is the current president of Nigeria that was declared by the INEC. Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yakubu. So, guys, I'm dropping it here. Kindly share your thoughts below the comment section. Thank you.